she'll be the last the handler scurries away ready to go in the golf Irish 1000 guineas and they're off and the favorite uh, heart of joy broke quite well towards the outside the caretaker is also close up on the inside performing arts is one of the leaders and uh, as they race through the first furlong or so performing arts on the left towards the right uh, heart of joy no great pace on early tanwi is close up wayne harris looking uh, across there and there's uh, no serious gallop at all in the early stages with performing arts in the lead followed by habira in second and they're followed in third place by annie laurie and behind annie laurie on the outside tanwi with needy Hatch, Amanada behind them on the inside track by uh, Wedding Bouquet and then the caretaker in Ring of Light but it's Sabira who leads them through in the groove as the back marker at this stage as they race down past the five furlong marker and it's Sabira performing arts over on the far side they're the leading pair performing arts in front Sabira second then Amanata then Annie Laurie Needy Thatch Tanby close up on the outside Wedding Bouquet just behind them then Lady of Vision and they're followed by Heart of Joy the caretaker Ring of Light and out the back in the groove as they run down now towards the uh, three furlough marker quickening the pace now performing arts Sabir in second Amanat at three and Tanwi four past the three furlong pole now performing arts over on the far side is the leader from Habira then comes uh, Amanata they're followed on the outside by Tanmi with Heart of Joy in the groove begins her run on the wide outside they're racing down towards the final furlong and performing arts over on the far side from Heart of Joy and in the groove up the centre of the track they hit the furlong pole now performing arts in the groove and Heart of Joy between horses in the groove on the near side in the groove storms clear inside the last furlong chased by Heart of Joy as they race into the closing stages in the groove sprinting to the line and in the puts up a very good performance to win the Irish Guineas. David Ellsworth's first classic, Heart of Joy is second, performing arts is third, Lady of Vision has run a big race, may just have snatched fourth from the caretaker, then Annie Laurie Amanada Tanwi and they're followed in by Annie Laurie with Ring of Light and uh, together at the back, Habira and Needy Thatch. A very, very slow pace uh, early on, but what a turn of foot that uh, in the groove produced uh, on the outside under Steve Cawthon. A most impressive uh, display with uh, Heart of Joy having uh, every chance and performing arts who uh, tried to steal the race there over on the far side running a big race too but uh, in the groove owned by Brian Cooper trained by David Ellsworth uh, has won the Goffs Irish 1000 guineas the judges called for a photo uh, for the placings but uh, a very impressive display indeed Ted I think you'll agree yes indeed Steve Cotton switched his filly off uh, Wallace Woodmore had Walter Swinburne had also switched into Heart of Joy off, but uh, Steve has drawn one on his outside here. He tracks Walter all the way, and when Walter makes his move, Steve makes his. Steve is circled there on the right of the picture. Uh, over on the far side, performing arts, Michael Hills had made the best of his way home. At this stage, Walter is aware of the fact he goes for Heart of Joy, and she immediately responds. But just look at the winner here on the stand side. She absolutely flies in the groove, finds another gear again, and goes right away. Heart of Joy is making hard enough work of getting to performing arts, but in the groove is in top gear and sprints away for Steve Collins. And, here. and this filly could really be an Oaks filly the way she went away here in the last 50 yards. She's won three or four lengths in very impressive fashion. A really clear-cut victory here for in the groove. Certainly